the post uh, natal or the postpartum bleeding sister Aziza from Qatar asked about its minimum and its maximum period of time of course in the mind of many laymen that the postpartum bleeding is 40 days but this is not the case what happens is there are some women after giving birth the bleeding stops a day or two a week or two or three after so once the bleeding stops perform ghusl and now you must offer the prayers on regular basis on time and if it is Ramadan and you are capable to fast you must observe fasting as well so there is no minimum it can happen soon after the delivery an hour later few hours later it depends it varies from a woman to another but the maximum is 40 days up to 40 days so even if there is bleeding after 40 days it will not be perceived as nifas or postnatal bleeding rather it will be dealt with as irregular bleeding what difference does it make it makes a big difference for the postnatal bleeding you don't pray and you don't have to make up the prayer you cannot fast but you have to make up the missed fasting no husband and wife relationship because this is like the menses okay but after 40 days you perform most you wear your pad even if there is bleeding it will be dealt with as an irregular bleeding you gotta pray for each prayer with an independent wudu you make wudu once it is the prayer time and if you are capable to fast you should fast as well uh, this is as far as the minimum and the maximum for the post